Uh, not to interrupt that, but I uh, need to spend as much time actually playing as possible because the stream has to be a bit shorter given the fact that I started a bit late. And I don't really remember what the hell I was doing last. Um. Oh yeah, I was trying to figure out what the hell to do in the hospital. <coughs> There we go. Well, I think I have a key to something, don't I? Alright, so I need the key to this. And I gotta figure out the combination of this. I wonder if it's 4389. Let me try. 4, 3, 8. Nope. <laughs> it was worth a shot. So let me see. Uh, wrong button. I need inventory. I need like a string or something to put that on. Birth. Oh, ha! Nice. I thought I had a key to a room. Let's check the map real quick and see what I haven't been through. That's right. There, what I need to see if I missed something in the special treatment room because I didn't see anything. When I went in there, but I could have easily missed something. Uh, World of Warcraft? No, I've, I've never played. Mostly, mostly not for lack of wanting to give it a shot, but mostly for lack of this the ability to pay for the subscription part of it. There's like nothing. See, oh, okay, there was something written on the wall. Let's say 8972. Turn, turn, turn the number, numbers. Better not forget them, so I'll write them down here. The other one, my secret name. Ah. <laughs> wow. Eight nine seven two. It looks like interesting. See, I knew I missed something when I went through here. Joseph looks. Oh, okay. Dead bodies strewn about the floor. Ah, oh, man. from bottom to top. Huh? 
Oh, uh, was it two nines? It was two nines. What the hell? I definitely look like a second seven. See that? I thought it was a seven. Look like a seven to me. All right, so now I just got to get the uh, the padlock off there, and I believe I can actually use Maria's knife to cut the uh, okay, to cut the rope on it. But uh, I don't think I can until later. What I need is. Something to hook onto the damn <laughs> padlock. Something to hook onto the damn push hook so I can get the uh that key out of the drain, because that's the key to the padlock. And that stupid drain. I was wondering if I could cut see if you cut the cut off that rope there, James. Not yet, I haven't. My MP has kind of been like fluctuating from where I've bought Evo Mats and stuff recently. I need to take some more time to start farming up my my uh, monster points again because I actually really want to buy El Hera with it. Light Hera Dragon I think looks really fun. That's probably my next goal is just to get her. Hey, Crash with the, two, the dual streaming. What's up, dude? Welcome back. Uh, static buff for god type, and then something else. Hold on. I don't remember her, uh, typing. I mean, her, uh, details. But, um, so I've got to find something to hook this fish hook onto. Lazy, lazy defines my gameplay as of recently. Uh, let me see here. There is sh shimmering thunder goddess Hera dragon. Uh, five times attack for oh, she's a five times uh five x firework and two x HP and attack for god and double types. So you get basically four x HP and attack, static buff for god and double types, and then uh five x firework. Which means Subaki will be going on that team, bro. Alright, um... Oh, nice. What'd you get, man? I've killed pretty much all the enemies, I believe, as of right now, so... Oh, I'm actually not familiar with that series. I'm actually not familiar with the author, either. Let me check out the roof again really quickly. There's no items over here, right? <laughs> uh, for me, I'm just I like I enjoy reading books. I'm just really, really picky about the books I read. Uh, 
Oh, okay, okay. So that's okay. So now, now we're on track. The name, like, John Carter sounds very, very familiar. 1915, Yeah, John Carter definitely sounds very familiar. Like, you know, if you said who's John Carter, I wouldn't be able to tell you in really any details, but I would be able to say that I've heard that name before. Oh, actually, let me go back out here and check all these other rooms first. Plus the stairs. Uh, looks like everything over here is just blocked off, right? Yeah. Yeah, there are several movies that I absolutely love that are considered failures or flops. Okay, okay. And this, uh, like I know of, I know I've pretty much killed all the enemies and everything, but this game is still like freaking me the hell out right now. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. This um, it's kind of sad when, when a character dies because the creator, uh, dies. And it it does it you know it has happened several times. <clears throat> this music is definitely definitely raising the creep factor. So I am out of grapefruit juice, which makes me upset. But on the bright side, I can use this wonderful leftover ice. <clears throat> and trace amounts of grapefruit juice to flavor my water here. Which I will do. Yeah, but Riddick's still a really cool character. Dude, I love me some grapefruit juice. I've been on kind of like a weird binge on it. Like, I drink big ass cup of it a day like I literally uh, one week I tore I tore through like uh, three bottles of simply grape well, not, at the time it was ocean spray but uh tore through about three bottles of grapefruit juice in a week one time which I have to be careful about it really is dude like it's absolutely awesome it's very healthy for you it's uh a lower sugar fruit, so you don't have to worry about it. if you have like blood sugar issues, you don't have to worry about it as much. And it actually can aid in fat burning, um, much like other citrus fruits. Right, so I've seen that.
But I was drinking uh, Ocean Spray that had no added sugar in it. That was 100%, but then I found Simply Grapefruit, and that's 100% with no added sugar, plus not from Concentrate, which is just a trio of awesome things. Alright, he's definitely looking at something. That's good. Lapis eye key. Ah, <laughs> nice. I wonder if Dizzy's ever played, uh... Ever played Silent Hill. I will say this. I was actually quite interested in the game that he was playing now until I saw the clip. And I was like, oh damn, I gotta check out now. That's that's just that's just too fucked up for me. I gotta figure out what that key unlocks. I don't think it's for the padlock. Dude, I enjoy uh so many games quite a lot. Um Especially Minecraft. Like, I love me some Minecraft. And I really want to stream Minecraft. It's just one of those things where I've got to figure out really something interesting to make the stream really cool because Minecraft's kind of a flooded market. Like, everybody who watches streamers play Minecraft are already watching um, someone else, basically. And with some of the the updates and stuff Minecraft has been getting even more of a want for me to play. Especially because I do a lot of like redstone builds. That's like the main thing that I love about Minecraft is the redstone builds. Shit, is his body still there? <clears throat> yeah, but I can't loot it now. God! Nice. <laughs> Shit, is his body still there? Wow. Ah, uh, that's hilarious. Which I can't laugh too hard because I do some I do pretty much a very similar thing. As well, I think my Layers of Fear playthrough was one of my best horror game playthroughs as far as streaming because I did some of the 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 funniest jump scares and shit playing through that game. I just really upset. God damn it! <laughs> ah, that's funny. Ah, uh, it's just persistent at this point. All right, so I guess I need to go check some locked doors and shit because I'm pretty sure this key does not unlock the padlock. It might. The key might be for the box itself. Like if the box, if the box itself has a lock. Then, uh, that's what that key might be for. But I'm, I'm guessing that the key is actually for one of these locked doors. Uh, not on this floor, it looks like. I'm gonna have to go to the next floor down. <laughs> uh, I guess I'll check examining room three real quick. Oh, that's where the typewriter was. Never mind. <clears throat> I was thinking I didn't check that room yet. Uh, so yeah, let's find the stairs it's out, and then pretty much immediately door in front of me. We'll head down to the first floor and check around there. Legendary siege. Ah, uh, it's not that bad. Um. If that's the one that has 3D yet, it's, it's it's pretty it's pretty good. Like it's pretty doable dungeon without too much um 
without too much struggle. I mean, I'm going to take a look at it real quick to know for sure, though. And not going down to the basement just yet. When we get into Hell Dimension, that's when we'll go, be going down there. I'm not looking forward to it. Uh, Sea of Trees, technical. Legendary Sea of Trees. Oh, that's, that's Seven Zard. That's Seven Zard. Alright, so that one, as long as you can deal enough damage to Seven Zard, you're, uh, you're not going to be hurting too bad. Uh, really the main thing is there's a couple of painful preemptives and a possible a couple of painful preemptives and a skill turn delay uh, alright so floor 4 is going to be a full team bind except for your your leads <laughs> 7 lizard <laughs> Seven Lizard. Um, so yeah, floor four is going to be a bit of a pain. Make sure you bring some bind clear for that or bind immune subs. <clears throat> oh, oh, okay. Um, if you have a really like low point button like below 50 points of damage button uh, it will help you on battle 5 because there's a Metatron Tama there which means that you have to kind of either delay it or deal 22 damage in two turns to it which means that you need to hit with pretty much every attribute both times And there's just Cerberus Rider. He's he's not too hard as long as you're careful. And the Seven Zard. See, I think uh, Floor 4, as long as you can buy and clear, you're good. Floor 5, you just have to deal with Metatama. Floor 6 is Jizei, and he's a 1 million damage absorber for 5 turns. Uh, so, you know, you just either have to slowly deal with him or um, stall that out or whatever you want to do. But pretty much every floor can be delayed or um, something like that. Okay, okay. Canopus. Oh man, who would have thought Canopus would be a sub in a team? So my recommendation, man, if you can't build the ALB 10 for it, definitely bring a delay. Uh, two if you can. And then just make sure you can deal a shit ton of damage to Seven Zard. Yeah, I figured the Azazel on Team B were for SDRs. Anyway. Oh, cool. Oh, yeah. It's, oh, man. That just reminds me. Ragwell. Um, I need to do Ragwell. I know they've been doing the Whale Door and Droclus and stuff. I need to catch Ragwell when they throw him. I still don't have a Ragwell. Have I not been through there? Oh, it's been locked, too. And I do really want a Ragwell. I haven't checked the kitchen door. Oh, that's that door's like blocked off, isn't it? Yeah, I think that door's just blocked off. Yeah, those two doors are completely blocked off right now. Alright. So, we need to check...
Well, can't leave. <laughs> he doesn't want to leave. So I just need to check that door and see if that door will unlock with this key. Why is this room so confusing to me? I keep having to check the map every five seconds. Wrong button. Okay. Oh. Well. Man, I am pretty stumped, actually. I guess I'll go through and check the examination room and the doctor's lounge and the other rooms real quick just to make sure that I'm not missing anything from there. But maybe this lapis lazuli key does indeed open that padlock. Alright, man. That door wasn't broken, was it? Oh yeah, examining room one is just completely inaccessible. Food only, do not store drugs. <laughs> So far, nothing out of nothing there that I seem to have forgotten. Let's check the reception office real quick. Well, there's got to be something in there, even if it's like a healing item or something. Different types of papers and documents. More papers and documents. Typewriter. Oh yeah, I've already read that, so... Let me see. This might seem a little silly. Can I combine it with the wooden plank? Oh no, I can't do a combine on that at all. worth a shot. <laughs> Grim Linda, welcome. Welcome to the kingdom. How you doing? Yeah, no. Um, I guess we'll see with this. Thank you. I appreciate it. Mighty indeed. Yeah, I've, I've been growing this beard for I should have had this beard for now, like, five years? Six years, maybe? 
problem with that. I started growing it before I met my fiance, which has been a little over. See, so yeah, it's about six or seven years actually I've had this beard. Um. No, actually, actually, no correction. Uh, about four years, four years, because about four years ago I actually. I messed it up when I was trimming it, so I had to cut it off and restart, which was rather upsetting. But, uh, luckily it didn't take an extremely long time for it to come back. Alright, I guess we'll, I guess we'll see if this lapis key goes to anything in... Floor 3, I believe, is the only other place with a locked door. Like I said, if, if I somehow manage to reach a uh, hundred like concurrent subscribers, then I'm, I'm, I might do that. Hey, what's up, Mars? Welcome back, man. Uh, I guess there aren't any locked doors up here. So yeah, maybe this key does go to the box then. And there aren't any locked doors in this area either. Unless I'm just crazy. Uh, not tonight, man. Like I said, if I wasn't having the issues, the technical issues I've been having with the phone and pad and everything. Yeah, that's fair. I guess, yeah, if, uh, okay, you know what, I can do that. Yeah, it is. Um, I've played through some of the game before, like years and years and years ago, but I had never finished it. And so for Shocktober, I figured I'd actually go through and uh, play it again. Yeah, okay, we could we could do that. Like twelve subs, twelve concurrent subs, and the subs can like everybody can vote on dyeing my beard a color. See, is there anything in here? Okay, no. So let's go test the lapis lazuli key. Lapis lazuli key on. Wait, what direction am I facing? Okay, I need to turn around. On the box. Oh, whoops. Yes, because you can't uh you can't just automatically use the key like a normal normal person. Okay. It was for the padlock, I wasn't for Oh. Few hairs. Wow, all that security just for a few hairs. Those hairs must have been really important to that dude. Dark green. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'll probably, you know, I'll probably will, uh, if I ever do get to 12 subs. The hell, if I ever get to, like, 10 subs. That's when I'll probably make the poll. But if I do get to 12 subs, I'll make a poll, let all the viewers vote, and, uh, we'll dye the beard. Because I feel like that would be kind of, kind of fun. Oh, wow, I gotta do it, like, in the spot. I can't just straight combine the items. Shower room, here I come. Once again, I appreciate the beard comments. It means a lot. Thank you so much. 
Let me combine, combine, use. Come on, James, you got this. There you go. Elevator key, all right. Uh, wait a minute. <laughs> Where's the first accessible elevator? That way. Boom. We are in! I don't want to be, though. Like, legit don't want to be. Floor 2, then. See what's going on down here. Ooh, what is MCOC? Marvel Con okay, okay, okay. Marvel Contest of Champions. All right. Is that down to floor one? Decided to head to floor two to see if there was anything interesting. Um, then I realized, oh yeah, no, there isn't. <laughs> so we'll head to floor one. Now floor one gives me. Oh yeah, that's right. I put my water in here. Ooh, creepy. Gives me access to this area, which I have not been to yet. Um, so we'll start at the restroom and work our way down from there. Lock is broken. And that door should be unlocked now. Boom. Ooh. Lock is broken on that door. I just straight up can't access this door down here, it looks like. Locked. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Open! C2, let's see it. Oh, hello. later. This is no place for a kid. There are all sorts of strange things around here. I can't believe you haven't even gotten a scratch on you. Why should I? I don't know, because maybe there's crazy shit happening. Wait, wait. There's something I gotta get. Later, okay? But it's really important. What is it? 
it. A letter from Mary. Huh? I want to go get it. Is that okay? Yes. Yes. There's something dubious going on here. What are you doing, Laura? I can't lie. I've actually I've actually seen this scene before. Laura, what are you doing? Laura, I tricked you. Open the door, Laura. What? Laura, you bitch. Oh damn. She brought out the fart face comment. Alright, I actually hate these things. They are so damn creepy. Okay, I've already got the gun equipped. There is like a cheese strat for them though, if I remember correctly. I just don't remember how to do it. You have to run them in circles and eventually they'll just get stuck in the corner. Ah oh, yeah, there it is. Alright, that one's dead. Come on, you bastard. Die! I should be counting these shots though I know exactly how many it takes. Oh. Oh, there's a third one! Seriously? Ow. for that grab. Those things are just creepy, dude. Oh, and there's the siren. There's the siren. That siren basically means... In a word means... You're fucked. And uh, everything has changed now, so basically it's like I'm in a whole new damn hospital. a bit more rust on everything. Just a bit of rust.
people who got some shotgun shells. Could also use some handgun ammo if you're offering. So we are now in what's known in the Silent Hill uh, sect as the Hell Dimension. <clears throat> Those two doors are just not working, so... Just from there on. I assume the elevator's gonna be working. Uh, how am I going on these? Let me go ahead and take one to get the max health there. Uh, oh, only 30 rounds left. That battle took quite a lot of my ammo. So the elevator does work. We're not gonna worry about that though. We're, at the moment, we're gonna take a look through all this. And I'll check C4, so I need C3, C2, C1, the restroom. Examining room two in the bath area. That door open, uh, is open. Kill that bitch real quick. Don't want anything to do with that. Well, right. Just heard random glass shatter. twice. <laughs> Was it supposed to do that? Because if so, I didn't like it. <laughs> I didn't like it at all. Lock is broken. Thank God. Oh, yeah, Another unlocked door. Oh, wow. Just right in front of my face. Oh! That bitch almost hit me. Game literally is just like a, a a game of standing in the right place at the right time <laughs> to not get hit by things. Right, this room is pretty empty. It looks like, aside from the health drink. Uh, which do I need to do? So, examining room two. I need to check out in the restroom, and then everything else from there. Uh, let's check out the restroom first. Lock is broken. Lock is broken. Let's check out examining room two. Lock is broken. Oh, lock is broken. What the fuck? Ah, oh, so it looks like I can't get into uh, the main hall that way. I'll have to take the stairs from somewhere else. So now there's a basement which I which was not there before. Let me assure you. Or at least it wasn't accessible before, I should say. Uh, the basement itself was probably there before, but I w would not be able to access it. Uh, I guarantee you something very important is going to be in that damn basement. And I'm not going to want to have to go there, but I'm going to have to go there. So let's check out floor two. Fucking nurses everywhere. <laughs> uh, 
There's one coming up behind me. Oh, I thought there was one. Okay. So there wasn't one coming up behind me. But it sure shit sounded like it. Ugh. I guess we'll start at the end of the hall and work our way down. Let's go down to M6. Med 6, let's go. It's open! Great. Hey, another first aid kit. I don't mind that at all. Or handgun bullets. Definitely don't mind that. The handguns become my primary weapon uh, as of lately. What the shit? I was locked up inside the basement's basement. It was so small and dark, and I was so afraid. I dropped my precious ring, but I will never ever go back there. So what the hell is this? This is Toroka. Whoops. Or are they just a sign of pain? I would say they're a sign of pain. So that's a drawing. I thought that was like a legit 2D texture meant to represent real hands or something, and I was like, this one. Uh, not your best work there. Dude, this game, this game has me like, uh. Really? Did you guys just fucking respawn on me? Can you not? Can you stay dead? Oh, looks like only one of them. No, no, it was just a fourth one. Wasn't it? The way they die, though. It's actually meant to be portrayed very sexually, but still. Legs all display and junk. This whole hallway probably smells of spicy tuna melt. Ah! Ow! No! Get away! Fuck you! Oh, and I gotta reload. <laughs> I didn't like that. I didn't like that at all. I didn't want to do that. Get low on handgun ammo. I need a first aid med. Thank you. Uh. Wait, was that a. When I picked that battery up, did it say dry cell battery? It's a D battery. Uh, so yeah, even though it's not actually dry, it's a paste, but whatever. Whatever. Dumb names. I hate that dry cell batteries are called dry cell batteries. I don't know why, it's just one of the small things that really... It's like a pet peeve. <laughs> it's just it's this dumb, stupid little thing to be bothered by, but for some reason it bothers me. Uh, not zombies or uh, okay. So, the the true way to describe the enemies in this game is manifestations of his emotions. Um, but uh, I guess you could think of them as zombie, zombie like. <clears throat> uh, in fact, this whole game is derived from his mental state. Um, he is literally creating everything he sees in Silent Hill. Oh, that door unlocked. That was a large room. Large rooms usually mean deadly things. Is Eddie going to be in there? No, James' weak ass just can't open it. The door is too heavy. Do you even lift, bro? Like, at all? Like, a piece of paper occasionally, even? Like, if that's a 250-pound door, that's one thing, but I, I feel like that door is no more than... 
50, 60, maybe 70 pounds at the most. Yeah, kinda. <laughs> Alright, so the map says there's a door there, but... That's what I'm thinking, I'm thinking like, I'm like, James, are you sure it's not just locked? Like... Yeah. Oh, come on. Don't give me that. Looks like I gotta hit the elevator again and go to the third floor. I know, right? Need a key to get a key. The door, that does happen. Uh. Whoo! Ha! Ha ha! Ha! Alright! Ha! For anybody that watches Rick and Morty, let's just say I almost got Swifty in here. Alright, well. That, that almost gave me a heart attack. Good God. Oh yeah, I'm a dummy. <laughs> I'm supposed to be playing with the lights off. There we go, that should be good enough. So you can see me without sacrificing too much of the game. Alright, uh, yeah, so... Uh, this whole time I was supposed to be playing with the lights off and I totally forgot to turn my light off. Well, even with the light on though, I was getting so into this game that uh, I didn't even... Like the light was no help. <laughs> she is an angel, no one knows only... Oh, she is an angel. There's no punctuation here. She is an angel. No one knows. Only I can see the lady of the door. They cannot walk along her bridge of thread. They fall from the weight of their crimes. Like bloated and ugly corpses, their sins, she devours them. Sin and sinner alike, she saves me. She is an angel. Okay. Oh, oh. Another one. Ah! Had to reload. How dare you? You're frightening me. All right, where am I at? Okay, so this is the one that I, that was unlocked. So let me move on to the next one. All right. Nothing but broken locks. I can dig it. That one opens. Really don't like the heavy breathing. It makes me nervous. You don't think Maria is in this dimension. Oh, let me check these two doors, and there's one other door I want to go. Yeah. That was just locked. Oh, the lady of the door. I wonder what I would need to put there. And I can give her a gun. Or he has a knife. Oh, 
Okay. Yeah, I wonder what that red stain is there, James. Hmm? What do you think, man? A little Kool-Aid or something, maybe, you know? She's cutting up in a Kool-Aid packet, then use the knife to stir in the mixture. Could be. Really could be. Ah, no more of these guys. I don't want to deal with these anymore. Ow, you bitch. Normally you only need three shots to go down. So, pro tip. Uh, these nurses actually... Um... Bobblehead nurses actually re react very strongly to your flashlight. And, uh... Have a harder time... Uh, dealing with you if your flashlight is off, but if your flashlight is off, you sacrifice the ability to use your map, as well as you sacrifice the ability to see as well. So, it's kind of a trade-up, you know? Do you want to, uh, do you want to have that map? The ability to see, or do you just not give a shit? And you just want the, uh, the easy battles. Uh, even so, it doesn't really make the fights too much easier for me, so I just, like, say fuck it and leave the flashlight on anyway. But, uh, yeah. Uh, check that elevator as well as access to the day room, which is most likely, most likely I will not have access to the day room. Yeah. Well, if one side of a room like that is closed, usually both sides are. That's just straight walled over. Elevator does not move, which means, oh, there's one door I haven't tried yet, which is the stairway. Of course the stairway works. Stairway, ooh, a save station, or save, save paper. That's good. Up or down, up or down. Let's check out the roof first. Oh, well, a bit of cave in on there. Lock is broken, alright. Good to know. No roof access. Looks we'll head on down to floor two. Alright, lock is broken for floor two. Head on down to floor one. Lock is broken. Excuse me. Alright. Hmm. Not looking forward to going down here. Basements are never a good thing in these games. Might as well. James. 
Mary? Maria. Oh, Maria. It's you. I thought you were... Sorry. Anyway, I'm glad you're alive. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? You don't sound very happy to see me. I was almost killed back there. Why didn't you try to save me? All you care about is that dead wife of yours. I've never been so scared in my whole life. You couldn't care less about me, could you? No, I just... Then stay with me. Don't ever leave me alone. You're supposed to take care of me. <laughs> so, what about Laura? Did you find her? Yeah, and that bitch yeah, fucked my shit up, bro. She ran away. We've got to find her. And... You really seem to care about her. Do you know her? I've never met her before. I just That's Maria. Sorry. She's all alone. Apparently looks reason, just like Mary. I feel like it's his dead wife. The need of protector. And I literally just met this bitch like um in the last video in the last stream. Copper ring. Anything else down here? <laughs> Fuck off! <laughs> I know, right? Like, seriously, she just, like, went straight up crazy on me. <laughs> Protection fee. Oh, yeah. We gotta go back to the third floor. Come on, woman, keep it up. She actually, um, how you treat her and everything, and how, uh, how you know, how you affect her actually affects directly affects the ending you get too. Uh, if you're like, for instance, if you're negligent of her, you leave her behind most of the time. Um, you keep too much distance between you and her, it can actually affect the bad, uh, effectively give you a very bad ending for the game. Uh, I don't think I need to save again right now. A lot of the stuff you do in this game can affect the uh, ending. Uh, I forgot where I need to go. Where's the Where's the door, lady bitch? Right there. That's where I need to go then. <laughs> Got a happy ending. <laughs> uh, health is a bit low. I'm gonna do a health drink. Should take care of me there. Uh, as far as the copper ring, slap that on this bitch's finger. Should unlock the door. I guess it needs more than a ring. Well, that's balls. <coughs> oh, sorry, Mary. Well, that's... But... Uh, I don't know what to do. Uh... 
Uh, well, that was my only lead, and now that's... That's fucked. So now I'm not too sure what to do. I'm really not sure. Uh, it's... Shit, dude. <laughs> no idea. Oh, that was locked. Is it this one? Maria, woman. This isn't the one, is it? Okay. Uh... Angel, no one. I, only, I can see the lady at the door. They can walk along her bridge of thread. Like bloated and ugly corpses, their sins devours them. <sighs> okay. This one, uh, this one, there it is. Maria, if you could offer up any type of help here, uh, friendly suggestion, anything like that, I'd be happy to listen. Instead of you standing there being a useless bitch. Let's head on back to the storeroom and see if there's anything in there that'll give me a hint. Because I uh, legit thought that all I needed was that ring. Apparently I was wrong. Oh, whoops. <clears throat> Apparently I was so very, very wrong. Uh, storeroom's right here, right? Yeah, I love how you're just standing there, useless, uselessly. You're a real treat to have around. Don't know what I'd do without you, besides make progress. Looks like I'm heading back to the elevator. Oh, hold on, we, okay, now yeah, I should be able to, with this bitch, I should be able to actually lift the, uh, Elevator door. Yeah, so back to the elevator. We gotta go to floor two. To the elevator. Wrong direction. What are you doing? Wait a minute. No, this was the right direction. What the hell? Am I, this, I just don't know how to... God! Nemo. What am I doing with my life? I need to go that way. And the elevator's down this way. Thank you. Click. Oh, come on, bro. What? Not liking this. Oh my god, I feel so... Um, happy. No, I don't want it. Is, what is the name of this amusement park? One, 
I believe it's Lakeside Amusement Park, actually. Oh, did I skip it by accident? Hmm. I was just trying to look at my menu, but okay. Didn't mean to do that. Yo, bitch, help me open this. You can't open it? Yeah. Maria, give me a hand here. Come on. You're supposed to be the big man around here. Hey, hey, look. Who's a little girl like me supposed to help? <laughs> Restart the game. I need you to win a prize. <laughs> No, you don't actually get to answer the questions in the elevator ride. You just hear the questions. What's this? Not very cute. It's mostly it? meant to be like a uh, oh, James. You take it. Mm, uh, nice. kind of a hallucination type deal. Ugh, hideous smell is coming from inside. I can only imagine. I can only imagine what that stank be. Let's do this. Damn it! Keep trying to open my inventory with the map button for some reason. There it is. Does that finally unlock the door? Thank you! Thank you! Finally! Go through the weird lady door. Oh, <laughs> staircase. Duh. I'm like, wait, there's a wall here. So that is hard to read writing. <clears throat> I took the director's... Oh, they can't spell. <laughs> I took the director's key, the one to the museum. I hid it behind the praying woman uh, when I went out for the day trip. I picked it up, but I did not steal it. I am not a criminal. Okay. Looks like the lock is broken. All right. I'm happy with that. Looks like the lock is broken yet again. That's fine. Well, ooh, I do not like this hallway. Uh, this descent into hell. Ugh. <sighs> Where am I? I check the map. Don't have a map of this area. <laughs> that sucks. Look at compartments. Yeah, I was right. Lakeside Amusement Park. <laughs> yeah, crim criminal. We put two M's in it. Oh! 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 Shit! Mary, you better haul ass, girl.
E. That can't be good. I gotta admit, that gave me quite the fright. <laughs> oh, and now the elevator starts. Ah, uh, no, that is a scripted event. Looks like he is in mourning now, given this music. Uh, do I have a map of this area? I do. This is... Yeah, I know where this is. I'm just going to try and get in the kitchen real quick, aside from the day room. about the history of Silent Hill. You gonna read it or not? He who is not bold enough to be stared at from across the abyss is not bold enough to stare at it to stare into it himself. The truth can only be learned by marching forward. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. <laughs> That's an interesting thing to see on a map. Follow the map. There's a letter and a wrench. You'll know what to do. Hospital lobby key. Laura, you bitch! I'm kinda sad that the piano pi- oh, the cool, it's resuming. Yeah, I like that piano piece. I'm gonna check the reception, pharmacy, store, room, visiting room. I just missed, okay. Right here. I do believe, like, mainly the director's room is pretty much the only other room you need to go into. And they just intend for you to leave afterwards. But, I've got to check all the doors. So yeah, every other door is either broken or... Go ahead and save. Yes, I wish to overwrite if you don't mind.
That's all right, bro. For one, you should stop asking a dead person for advice. So it is currently nighttime in Silent Hill, which is never a good time. Gonna go down and check Rendell Street. Let's go take a look at Rendell Street. Oh, there's creepy things out at night. What the hell are nurses doing outside? Ooh! Darling, baby, you got a little too close there. Did not appreciate the proximity. Personal space bubble, please. This bitch at. So I assume this way is just blocked off. Oh, but there is a health drink and a first aid med. Alright. Yeah, this way is blocked off. It pays to look around. Come on, get her before she gets up. Boom. Stop running away. Take it like a woman. How many enemies are down here, dude? Hate this. Oh. She went down on three shots. Oh, it sounds like they're fucking everywhere and I can't see any of them. It's so annoying. Ah. Oh. So stressful. Rifle? And gun bullets. Well, the rifle shots, I don't know too much about those, but handgun bullets I can get behind. Holy shit! Shotgun shells. Rifle shells, shotgun shells. Ah, oh, no handgun bullets. Come on. You gotta treat a man. You gotta treat a bro. Come on now. Give me the good stuff. Some handgun bullets. Keep out. Where? Oh, you can grow a tree any time of the day. Come on. There's never a bad time for botany. Oh, you went down to two shots. Oh, I kicked you right up the freaking butt, dude. Right up the old, right up the old butthole. 
Guess since we can make it this far, let's go down and check Saul Street. Die, bitch. Oh no! I've run out of handgun ammo! This is truly disastrous! <laughs> well, they're all female, so it would be a she. Which, I don't know if that makes it better or worse. Let me take a moment here to... All right. Eh, is this handgun bullets? Hell yeah. It's uh, actually a lot of the monsters in this game either are female or have a feminine tone to them. Um, or are a combination of a male and female figure uh, kind of mushed together. I guess somebody set those out for me. So here, let me set these health drinks out for some random guy that's going to be coming through here. I'm sure he won't mind. <laughs> I love that, dude. Hell yeah. This is actually where I was supposed to go, it looks like. I did not like the sound of that. One bit. Oh! Oh! That thing! Oh, I hate those things. They're so creepy, dude. I'm outie. Oh, and there's so many of them. Ah. Uh, uh, I don't like it. Ah. Uh. This game's got me on ass, bro. Said in this little RV looking trailer thing. Ooh, safe spot. Okay, cool. I'll wait at Bar Neely's. But is Bar Neely's on the other side? Oh no, Neely's bar, there it is. Alright, so I need to go to Neely's bar too while I'm at it. Wasn't trying to exit the stupid little RV thing. Let's go ahead and get a save. Glad to be out of the hospital, but man, Silent Hill at night is no better than that hospital. In fact, it might be quite a quite on par with it.
feel like if I shoot this with a gun, it'll do something for me, but I don't take the chance. One thing I definitely want to do uh, as a kind of a small mod for my Xbox is replace the data cable, IDE data cable, with a like a really good one. Because that is like a small hardware mod you can make to your Xbox that can actually improve it pretty, pretty drastically. What was this new lease? Oh no, I'm like, I'm gonna take a whole. Got a whole little ways to go before I get there. Hey, mannequin. Those are pretty easy to deal with. I don't mind the mannequins so much. I hate those damn nurses, though. Those nurses creep me the hell out. Man, there's bullets strewn all about this place. There we go. Hey, Ziggar, welcome back, my friend. Welcome back. Came at the perfect time to see all the spoopies. We're heading off of Saul Street now. So now we need to head up to Neely's, Neely's Bar right quick. Valkyrie Fenrir is awesome, don't even. I am grateful. But no, I don't have, I don't have, I don't really have the team or uh, enough Fenrir's to build for uh, the Dark Dark Fenrir. Well, just, he's not Dark Dark, he's just Dark, but the other Fenrir, so, uh, you know, Fire Red Fenrir was the only one that was even sensible for me to make. Would love to have some dupe Fenrir's, that would be nice. All right, we got a bubblehead nurse. And a mannequin. Oh god, I hope I hope you're not serious. Is this Neely's bar? If you have 400 Fenrir's in your box, you, you might want to contact Gung Ho. <laughs> That's something, uh... Well, here's Neely's bar, but I can't really... Uh, feel like that's, uh... It's an issue with the rim there. You took a few extra hits. There was a hole here. It's gone now. Okay. If you really want to see Mary, you should just die. That's fucked up. But you might be heading to a different place than Mary, James. That's fucked up. Oh boy, that is fucked up. Ha <laughs> ha. That is real fucked up. You know, I gotta figure out what team I'm gonna clear OSC with, because I'm really thinking of Nublos. Um, I just don't know for sure.
my alt really needs a Diabolus friend really bad to even have a shot at OSC. Hey, hey, get back here. Yeah. Uh, I think it's dependent on... Uh, I really think it's dependent on the, um... Like the usual, it's dependent on your starter dragon. It might actually, okay, it might be random because you don't get the radar dragon as a drop. It drops, it's the same drop no matter which radar dragon you get, so. It might honestly be random, but I think it's a fixed setup. Oh, that's right, they changed it to something else based, based off something else. Oh, yeah, I think it's actually based off your uh, your ID. Now they cycled. It wasn't the. It wasn't since the first OSC. They cycled all three radar dragons based off your starter, so you had a chance to get all three radar dragons. Um, when they started that whole thing from the OSCs, but uh, after that they changed it. To base it off something else, and I was told, I was either somebody, either either somebody told me or I read that it was based off of uh, your friend code, like your ID. Ow. <laughs> All right, that way he's blocked off. There we go. Down with you. Oh, the kick is what does it, man. Oh, where am I? About right where I need to be. Oh shit! Ah! Oh, oh god damn it! The cap is the dizzy. Ah! <laughs> ah! Uh. Uh.
That was louder than I was expecting. Ah. Uh. Uh, hold on. I've got to restart my heart. I need a moment. <laughs> uh, thank you, Dizzy, for the host, man. Holy shit. Oh, man. Ouch. Ouch. The timing could not have been any more primed to really fuck me up. Thank you so much for that house, dude. I really appreciate it. Ah. Uh. Alright, uh... Where the hell am I? I am not going in the right direction. Still not going in the right direction. Oh, not that get out of here. Hold on a sec. Is my chat broken? I just realized I haven't um, seen Nightbot like at all in chat whatsoever for a while now. Uh, seems to be alright. Need to double check Nightbot in a minute. In the meantime. Let's see if I can figure out where the hell I need to go here. Whoa! Did you just spawn out of that room? Oh yeah. Damn combat mechanics, man. Get out of here! Oh man, my health is really low now. Ooh, yeah, that's bad. There we go. Hey, Dizzy, if you're here, man, thank you once again for that host. I really appreciate it. Alright, how do I get into this location? Are you spawning from the blood? I guess that was going on. Yeah, I think that's what's going on. It says that's where I'm supposed to go. I may need to enter from the cafe Texan or something. I don't remember all the rules of this game. Um, I can't remember if this game's enemies ever respawns enemies in the outside, in the overworld, so to speak. I know in most of the buildings the, there's a fixed number of enemies. But I, th I don't know if it, like at nighttime or something, uh, when you're in the overworld, if it's uh, a 
if they ever like regenerate or anything like that. Or perhaps you are a fool. The truth usually betrays people. A part of that abyss is in the old society. The key to the society is in the, oh, is in the park at the foot of the praying woman inside of the ground inside of a box. To open it, I need a wrench. My patient buried it there. I knew it, but did nothing. It made me uneasy to have such a thing near. I wasn't looking for the truth. I was looking for tranquility. I also saw that thing. I fled, but the museum was sealed as well. No one dares to approach that place. If you still do not wish to stop, James, I pray to the Lord to have mercy on your eternal soul. Who are you, bro? Oh, no. I was trying to pick up the key. I wasn't trying to... Bro, come on. I'm trying to pick up the key here. Oh, it's a wrench. Pull like a key from here. <laughs> Whoops. Hashtag clearly not a key. Yeah, this is, uh. Oh, there's more enemies. Hey, you bitch! Get out of here! James, James, hit the woman. Jesus. Bro. <laughs> it is a key item. Ow! Don't do that! Thank you. Die now. Hang on, bullets. That's actually really, really good. Alright, so I got the letter on the wrench. I need to head to Rosewater Park now. Question is, how do I want to go about getting there? Right now, I think I'm going to take Cat Street, then through Neely Street. I'll check out Neely's Bar again. Then I think I'll take Saul Street through there and then go up to Rosewater Park from the bottom. Um, as opposed to going through the apartments again. I really don't want to go through the apartments again. Like, even if they're the same as before, I do not want to go through those apartments again. Whatsoever. I probably could actually unlock that gate from the other side. Oh, that's true. If I need the wrench to open something, technically it still can be a key. <laughs> we get a bar and a street. Ow! Rude! Ass! Bitch! Done with you. Oh, my health is low. Alright, so I need to keep straight. Oh, whoops, I didn't mean to take two. Shit. Whoopsie. That was a waste of health, Drake. Not happy about that. Well, that's butt. Oh, never mind. That's not even the street I was going to take. Not so butt anymore. Right, let's not have any more enemies for a bit. <laughs> Check something real quick.
I knew I forgot to do something. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> I actually forgot to open up stream my stream labels, which I normally do. Uh So forgive me for just a second while I open that shit up. Which actually with the event list that I have now, I don't think I actually need to open stream labels anymore. Because I'm not running the normal... Uh, Alerts. But anyway, I'll have it open anyway, just in case. Alright, sorry about that. Sorry about that. I just wanted to get that done. There's always something small that I forget to do whenever I... Alright, so we're taking... Was this Cat Street? Oh no, we just straight up passed Neely's Bar again. I wanted to hit Neely's Bar one more time. Cute cat. <laughs> there's the door. Let me make sure that there's no other items or anything in here that I'm missing. Aside from the various text on the wall, that's uh... Uh, so from the various insulting text on the wall, it doesn't look like I missed anything from there. So now I'm just going to head down south, back to Saul Street, and then go through from there. This place looks so creepy at night. I don't like it. Another first aid kit. Now that is definitely a welcome item. One that I can appreciate. Another one! Ho ho! Now they're just getting a little generous. Thank you. Alright, I kind of want to save real quick again before I cross through that wretched ass. <laughs> ho ho! Uh Now saving. I kind of did like the DMV voice there, just now serving E-256 in window number B. Oh yeah, that's right, that's not the door there. That's not the in and out door. <clears throat> Boom. Kahlo with red mirlos is kind of fun. Yeah, no, I don't want any part of that. There's a hole there. Why is there a hole there? There's a hole there. Were those holes there before? I don't think they were. <laughs> Getting lost in a mini trailer. I know, right? What's wrong with me? Alright, so as disgustingly terrible as that place is, Uh, I'm going to check and see if I can go up that street that's apparently supposed to be closed off. Oh, 
Damn it. Attack, damn you. Uh, this game is not very well praised for its combat mechanics, let me just say. Really? But uh, let me also say that this game does not need to have amazing combat mechanics because it's just amazing in its own right in every other way. Alright, so the block oh, the block off is apparently the cutoff is supposed to be like right up here. Is it still Yeah, it's still ripped off. Or walled off I should say. Where does bitch at? Really? Why do you all keep hitting me so much? I don't like it. And now my health is really low. Damn it. Alright, so we're going to have to go up Rendell Street. All the way up to Carroll Street. You dead? You're dead. These bastards are definitely spawning. There we go. Two flawless victories. Oh no, still got a ways to go. Oh, shit! <laughs> Damn it, I've got to turn down my alerts volume. <laughs> That's the second time an alert has just, just fucked me up. But, uh, uh, Segfault, dude, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the kingdom, my friend. Welcome. Uh. <laughs> Twitch is scarier than Silent Hill 2 right now. <laughs> nope, nope, can we please, can we, can we, thank you. Can you go down now? Okay, no, don't, don't, don't thrust again. Come on, man. Thank you. Come on, James. We gotta work on your combat skills, bro. Oh, no, not another one. No. Ah. Go. Okay. How's my health looking? Not great, right? Oh, not terrible. Where am I? Oh, I'm on Carroll Street. Alright, so that's the hospital I just came out of. So I need to head up to Heaven's Night, go through there, and then through the other gate, and head up past Pete's Bolarama over to Rosewater Park. I might stop at Jackson. I might see if I can unlock that gate over there too. What is it? I don't want to do any extra exploration. Uh, it might be helpful in the future to have that other gate unlocked. Hey guys, dump truck just parked on the side of the road. Oh, that's a trailer dumper too. That's like a heavy duty dump truck. Did you just did you just like nearly 90 degree turn? James. What is wrong with you?
Okay, yeah, this is where I need to go. What? 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 You mean I have to take the long way to Rosewater Park? Do you mean to tell me I have to take the long way to Rosewater Park? Oops, no, that was trying to do. Are you salting my french fries? Are you salting my french fries right now? Did you just butter my toast? Come on James, you can pass through that. Come on dude. As long as the road's not just completely out, you can you can easily just slip right on through. I can't even. Can't even right now. That does not work for me. Oh, that so does not work for me, dude. Oh. No. No. That is just so long of a journey. On the right side, I got shotgun shells. Man, I'm going to have to pass through that area again. Give James a breath. Let's go. James, I'm glad you got some good cardio on you, man. We gonna be having a, we got a, quite a trip to make. Quite a trip. Make sure I'm heading in the right direction. Yeah, I'm heading in the right direction. It's just a long road. need to kill anything that way. I just need to go this way. Not want to pass through this area again. This area creeps me out so bad, man. Ugh. Those are the kind of creatures that have put the fear of God in you. I don't really need to save. Happy Burger. I guess I need to pass through the apartments again. That's the only way up there. I'll head up to Neely Street and take a left. I'll try to pass through that locked gate first before I try to pass through the apartments. The last thing I want to have to do is pass through those apartments.
Uh, I guess I should have expected that. There we go. Yep, there's another one. Oh, well. Hey! There we go. It's open now. We do not have to pass through the apartments. This is good news, yes. Should I explore the rest of Cat Street? Why not? Ow! Stop! Attacking me! Assault is not legal! Slowly running out of health items. How many hang bullets have racked up? 60? Let's just start with the gunplay. Did she get me? I couldn't tell. Oh, she did. Ha! Oh, dude, let me tell you. <laughs> you know what? I've made the point of admitting the fact that I suck this game. I suck at this game. Uh, like two streams of this game ago. <laughs> Oh, speaking of which, um, speaking of past streams, so yeah, I finally got uh, the finale of Fatal Frame up on YouTube now. So yeah, the whole Fatal Frame playthrough is now on YouTube, and I'm pretty happy about that. Alright, so that just literally, legitimately ends. about it. She can only run so fast. No items on the stairs. Alright, where are we at now? Uh, we just need to head straight up near Jack's Inn and then we can go to War Rosewater Park from there. We'll save at Jack's Inn. Back up a bit. How many bullets do I have left in this thing? Run it, wrong button. 30 shots left. Really? He just fired at nothing, man. enemies. Why are there so many? There you are. That game sounds really familiar. I think I remember there being a game called Brute Force that came off the original Xbox. 
and it was up to four player co-op there's four characters to choose from kind of like classes I just wanted the save paper I don't want to get up in here Like when you combo and pad, huh? Not even worried about these uh, these nurses at this point. They just wanna. Take care of the ones that are directly in my way. After that, I've kinda gotta conserve my ammo. Ammunition. Oh, more ammunition. Speak of the devil. And you shall be surrounded by his minions. Alright, bring statue. Oh, brains versus brawn, okay. But yeah, dude, there was a game called Brute Force that came out for the original Xbox. Uh, I think it was actually originally delayed because it was supposed to come out at launch, if I remember correctly. But um, it was a pretty cool game, too. It was just kind of hard to play because it had it was pretty heavy RPG elements. Dig. Dig my puppet. The uh the sound effects there. Bit heavy. Bit heavy on the ears. <laughs> Ugh, I keep pressing the wrong button. I'm used to Resident Evil where you press that button for inventory. I still got that battery. I used the wrench! What does it say? Old building key? Uh, where would that go to? The Silent Hill... Oh, that's right. Silent Hill Historical Society. I gotta go to the museum now. Old bronze key. To the museum! Shit, which direction do I need to go? Not that direction! Not downstairs, but... And just continue in this direction, pretty much indefinitely. Check out Pete's bowl of ramen real quick, see if Eddie's still eating pizza at the bowling alley. All right, bowl of ramen, yep. But Tex on gas. Care about text on gas. Wow. Hey, the Bolorama is still open. Oh, it's nice to see a building that's lit up. Oh, I guess that he left. Uh, 
don't think there's anything useful. Worth checking it out real quick though. Yeah, it's pretty much empty. Eddie is definitely gone. I mean, it's probably a smart decision on his part. Ooh, still got quite the walk. She's far enough out of my way. Oof. Nope. Still not doing it. I've killed enough of those things. a lifetime. There's an item there. First aid kit. Love it. I'm in! Oh, okay, I was really hoping there'd be a safe, safe station here. This place looks pretty tore up. Uh, I don't have a map of the area, I don't think. But it's a small building. So what I'm actually going to do... Oh, yeah, it's real late. Uh, let me go ahead and save here. I'm going to go ahead and get off and get me some sleep. Uh, now, I wasn't originally going to stream this late. I was just going to stream for like maybe an hour, hour and a half, and then I just really got into the game. Uh, whoopsie. Uh, well, probably, depending on how I feel tomorrow, how tired I am, because I work, um, until kind of late tomorrow. I might not, uh, I might not stream Silent Hill. I might just stream a little bit of pad for the night. Just depends on how I feel. Um, I do plan on streaming at least a little bit of something, uh, tomorrow night, but... Like I said, I just don't know if I'll stream this or pad. But, anyway, apart from that, thank you everybody so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you again, Dizzy, to the for the host, man. That was really awesome. Uh, I'm trying to think if there's anything else important I wanted to talk about. I feel like there was something. Yeah, I don't think... If there was anything, I'll just post it in Facebook. But, uh, yeah, so... As we continue on through Shocktober, I may actually make a change to the list. I may add Silent Hill 4 to the list. Uh, just depends on if I can get a copy quick enough. Silent Hill version bed bugs. Oh, those bed bugs are... No, I don't want those bed bugs. But it depends on if I, if I can get a copy of Silent Hill 4 quick enough for my original Xbox. But, um, yeah, anyway, apart from that, thank you everybody so much for watching. I really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Thank you again, Dizzy, for the host. That was awesome. Uh, this night has been pretty freaking awesome. I had a fun run uh, with Dizzy on stream and everything earlier. Uh, so, yeah, the gates of the kingdom must close for now, but they will open again soon. But in the meantime, and as always, stay metal, my friends, and stay awesome. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now.